Hello everybody and welcome back to Dimmerborn once again. And just as a um, full disclosure, I mean, uh, I am recording, well, pre-recording this episode directly after the previous one, which I think was episode 18. Yeah, just so you know, um, I have not seen any of the comments. Um, and the reason why I say this is because, um, because of the plans for what I'm going to do in this episode. I think we will start off by naming a few beavers. We've got a few brave souls over here, so let's give them a name first. So let's welcome our first new colonist, and that's going to be Vampire Penguin. There we go, and Vampire uh, Penguin, you seem to be working at the distribution post. So welcome, welcome. Our next beaver that's joining the colony will be called... STB, and I know you've uh, watched pretty much all of the Timberborn video, so thank you very much for your support and welcome to the colony. Now, the third beaver that's joining our colony will be Clyde Ma. Let me just try and spell it correctly Clyde Maverick. Uh, thanks very much for your support, Clyde, and welcome to the colony. And the final beaver joining our colony will be JC Boom OG. Alright, thank you for the support and welcome to the colony. Now, moving on to our next project. There's two things I really want to do in this episode. Uh, first of all, I was looking at around the colony and uh, especially around here, we've got this massive lake. But it just feels there is not enough trees. And this lake just feels very naked for some reason. And because of that... I think we should try and put a few a few trees actually inside the lake. I think it might uh, might look pretty cool when there's a few of them growing around like so. Oh, this is a little bit smaller one, so maybe maybe not. I think in this corner we'll do we'll just spread them out a little bit so it doesn't look so. Um, uh, I don't know unnatural how about something like that and maybe a few in the lower parts as well yeah i think that would be that would look really cool uh let's try and switch up the angle a little bit few in here couple there maybe along this road here as well And I think, uh, yeah, it's probably going to take a little bit of time. Oh, quick autosave. But uh, we'll just scatter them around. Um, let's see now. Maybe a couple more in there. And that should look a lot better and I guess more, more organic in a way as well. One more. Okay, well, once they've grown up a little bit bigger, then uh, we'll see if we want to keep all this or maybe change it up. Uh, a few more in here. And that should look pretty, pretty good, for starters at least. I think over here as well, maybe we'll... Yeah, let's put a... Um, no, let's leave it. Let's not go too crazy. And a couple of trees there. This looks very bare as well. We do want to come down a little bit. A little bit lower. And also fill this area. Oh, I think we did plan to do it here as well. Can we up the priority? Actually, can you even reach there? Yes, you can. Okay, we should see some beavers coming uh, towards there as well. Now, our second plan, we'll, we'll come back to the uh, landscaping in, in here in a little bit. Uh, quick usual check for the colony. Actually, this looks a little bit odd here, so let's try and finish this, uh, what do you call it, like a, like a dam. Let's finish this off as well, because it's a little bit annoying how it's always uh, just unfinished wall over here. And here they seem to be lacking roads. So, let's try and help them out a little bit by putting a few roads down. 
Yeah, this side should be enough. And same. Same up there, really. Are you connected now? No. Now you are. Okay. And they've already dropped the resources in there as well, which is very, very quick. Oh, I almost missed it. But there is a drought coming in soon. We're still pumping in water into this lake as well, so... And yeah, the usual flooding in this location. Right, so in the last episode we talked about putting in this dam over here. And um, I think I sort of measured out how high it's going to be as well. So one up from this plateau. So let's use platforms. So that is going to be the height of uh, of the dam. Yep. This, these two plateaus are the same height. Because let's just double check. Yep, that looks the same. And it's two up. This is two up from here as well, so that's the same height. We'll come around. Uh, not that side. Wait, where are we trying to go? Oh, we're going here. Okay, so from here, this height, it's going to be three. Three up now. Right, that is definitely going to flood everything. This is four up. Ooh. This is still three. So I've got already... Well, I sort of accidentally built those platforms here. But that's the same height. Then we're going into two up in the farms here. From here it's one. Hmm. So that means... Is it really this high? Oh, it must be then. Okay, so it means we are going to need this higher. Right. Could we check same with you guys. Okay, we'll put a few more levees in place. Triple stack floodgates. And then, I suppose something like that will pause you. And what we really need here is a new district center. Now, this is going to be a temporary one. So let's, uh, oh yeah, it's gonna have to be in this platform for the time being. Which I suppose is okay. And we need a gate. And a couple of roads. Okay, in this district. Let me just put down a few roads. Actually, wait, the gates should be more, let's just double check, yeah, I think we're going to stick the gate in here instead, because we also want to build up uh, this area there, so let's remove you, another road, uh, that looks a little awkward here, so let's get rid of these roads there, and now we need to, well, Transport some resources here, which if I remember is, yep, yeah, that is the good location. I think we can just put one over there, bit more storage. Uh, that should be fine, yep. And now our distribution center, hmm. Yeah, we can do a few more routes in here. So first of all, I want to bring some, let's see, explosives. Yep. Okay, and we'll start the uh, time again as well. Let them get on with this. Then we also need a few logs. Where are the logs? Um, up here. And food-wise, what could be the best thing to bring over? Hmm. Berries. Let's try and get rid of those berries. So, here we go. We got berries in now as well. I think... Let's see. We got... Oh my god. Wow. 31 unemployed. Okay. Um, that's, that's, that's quite a few. So, let's... Um, 
migrate a few. Equal to four for starters. They are going to become builders straight away as soon as they reach here. When they reach here, of course, yep. Oh yeah, we also need water. Otherwise, they're going to die of thirst. I'm just afraid that these beavers are still transporting stuff to District 3. Let's see. Let's just double check. We got... Yeah, they're pretty much done with blanks. Don't think... Well, paper's fine. Dynamites are fine. So no, they're not going to bring any of that stuff over. I think they're still doing probably bread. But we'll see. Did we send over water? Not yet. Okay, we'll send over some water as well. And I think the first thing we should really... Well, not the first. I mean, second. We'll have to provide some temporary housing. And we'll pause just these two. Have any beavers arrived? Did I mess it up? Most likely, I, I must have done something wrong, so... Migrate for adults. Yes. So we did something wrong before. Okay, they should be coming over any time now. And then what we'll do is um, we'll get them to build all this stuff. Once we have some resources. I think they're bringing some over now. Actually, what would be very smart? Well, not very smart, just a little smart is to drop um, this log pile here and hopefully these beavers well maybe they'll be able to um, steal the logs from this storage because I know they will be starting to transport these logs over because they're pretty pretty full over there so anyone that doesn't have a job they'll, they'll definitely bring some logs over I think another thing we could do here is uh, no, they're pretty stocked with, uh, with everything. I'm just afraid that these beavers are going to not make it, so... You know what? We're gonna send you back. Just for now. Yeah, go home. Also, because the drought is starting now, we are just gonna pause those water, water pumps over there. Ooh... Okay, you know what? Um, water is going to be an issue. Because these are flooding. Hmm. Okay, let's turn on these pumps over here. Because I think the water level... Oh, it's just about, I think. Well, I guess we'll see. And, okay, almost, almost morning now. They, hmm. They put in the resources. Do we have any resources here? No, we got nothing. Okay, we are also, uh, ooh. Everyone's pretty thirsty. Okay. You know what? It's fine. I'm sure we'll send over over some water soon. As soon as we get access to some of it. And we've got the beavers in now as well. And look at that. These are some hard-working beavers. I think we got some water. Yes, we do. So what this means, we can send over two more beavers. To fill the housing units. Okay. Awesome. It seems the water level is going down as well. These pumps should be working very shortly. Yeah, I hope they come back online. And we got some storage units. Let's see where... Why do you guys... Where are you running? No, so they can't reach this one. What about... If we move it down a little bit. Is that going to help you? Okay, he's able to construct it.
Hmm. We, I don't think we need this lumberjack here. Can't take this one out. Uh, anyone? Okay, I guess we'll see. And dynamite's in place now, so that's nice. Have they started building anything else here? I think they have. Can't get all the required metal uh, materials. Right, so this must be out of reach then. And they haven't brought any in. Okay, let's just double check the water situation as well. Right, so the water level's gone down, which is good. Now we got loads of bumps working. We'll check District 2. Seems okay. How about you guys? Well, oh, yeah. You have enough, enough water as well. Okay, so we do have a few logs in here now. Just really want to see if they're going to use any of this stock. No. Oh, of course, they're not going to do it right now because it's night time. We'll speed up the time during night and let's see what happens in the morning. Really want to get this in place. Especially the bridges over here so then we could get across. Take these trees down. And then I think we'll make some sort of a ladder system to go down from here. Uh, then we've got berries in the way. And yeah, we just want to hop there. Maybe all the way to the top. And then start building across. Yeah, let's give it a try. Actually, we're going to put it on the side in case we want to further increase the le uh, level of those levees. Okay. Is anyone taking the logs? They are not. Well, that is interesting. Wait. Right, we've done something wrong because they're not bringing those logs over. Let's just double check. We got water, berries. There are logs. Oh, and dynamite. Okay, now they've brought, brought in a few logs. Let's see what they build first. We are going to need some planks as well. Just lagging a little bit. And uh, when we're on uh, speed number three. So let's uh, ship over a couple of logs. And that's uh, the, the limit of our uh, routes as well. So planks. Off you go. Might have to put in another distribution center. Actually, that might not be a bad idea. Since we got so many unemployed beavers. Yeah, let's do one, like, literally here. And another drop-off point. And what we'll do is we'll... Use this one to ship over logs. And perhaps water. Or planks. Let's do logs and planks. And here they go. Okay, again, we have this built, please. Logs are in. Just need a few more planks. Just double check. How come we have so much bread? But carrots are not doing well at all well how about we throw in a few more carrots in here and I think we should remove this road here as well yeah maybe even even this one okay a couple more carrots could be squeezed just in there just wonder, do they have reach? Yes, they do. Oh, and of course, here as well. Cool. 
Let's just check on the progress. What's What's been happening here? None of the levees are built. Which is interesting. Wait, are we... Oh, we don't have blanks anymore. Right, we used so many... Uh, when we built this uh, warehouse or storage unit in the, in the previous episode, I think we had like... I'm pretty sure we had more than a thousand planks, but we've just run out of all of it. In that case... We may just have to improve our... Blank factory here. Hmm. How are we gonna do that? Well... I guess the solution, really... Is to... Well, the easiest is going to be here. So if we empty, empty this storage first, we could to... I think two. Let's uh, double check lumber mill. Yeah, that's going to be perfect. And I want to replace... Um, you as well. Let's put a T junction in here. Nice priority. Okay, I think a few beavers have already started hauling out the, the logs from here. And let's check our distribution center. How far are we? Yep, we're just waiting for more planks. Let's give you the highest priority, actually, as soon as some planks come out. Let's ship them over. Um, do we have any... Yes, we have some in storage here. What are you still receiving? Berries, carrots... I don't think we need them. So, we'll cancel the berries, carrots, and planks as well. Logs, I think... Hmm. They are producing their own logs. There aren't a lot, so we can, we can leave this one in. I think you guys are still bringing over some logs too. A few storage units here. Nothing... Oh no, there is one. Okay. So that's okay. Now, let's go... Back to this side. Right, beautiful. Distribution center is complete. Let's put a few more beavers working, working in there. And we need a few routes. So first one being... Logs. And the second one... I think we wanted planks. Yep. Now I wonder... What if we do another plank... Um, another, another, one, another one for logs. Uh, does that mean... Because here, for example, let me, let me try and explain it this way. It seems each resource... Uh, if you have selected three, and the max capacity is 300, then each of those resources can... Um, can hold a max of 100. Uh, once you have four routes, uh, those numbers will obviously be lower. But I'm just not sure if it's uh, only two routes. Does that affect... Uh, does that mean you're gonna get 150 resources? Not sure. I think the levees seem to be coming along quite nicely here as well. Got a few in already. So that's pretty good. Not sure why they can't get all the required materials. Okay. Maybe now they can. Uh, not sure why I'm still building this here. That must be a mistake. Oh, yeah. Let's remove those levies that are not needed. Okay, I'm gonna let the beavers... Just build these sections over here, and then as soon as the night is over, we'll come back.
Hof construction builder beavers have finally managed to finish the the dam that uh, is literally um, well I mean pretty much the first link in our bigger project should we should we follow that that route it took them quite a quite a few days but now that it is complete and with our I guess we'll we'll call it the scouting district over here that pretty much marks the end of this episode so thank you very much for joining once again and I do hope to see you in the next one.